Hi, welcome to Cell World, where you can look like this family right here on your vacation. Except that you really won't, because going to an amusement park alone is really weird. Why would you do that? Why would you only get one ticket? That's so weird. But anyway, this is Cell World, and here's why you should come. Okay, so first we have the nucleus, where the big boss who controls the park lives. And yes, he actually lives here. We have our cell membrane, which is guarded with gates and security guards. It is also the cell membrane's job to choose what goes in and what goes out. So, if a criminal gets into the park, these are the ones to blame. And just for extra protection, we have our cell wall to give the park, you know, that really structure and protected feeling. Also to keep you in here forever. Anyways, do you like to float? Great! Because now, we have a ride called the Cytoplasm Spectacular. And it does look like the Cousin of Among Us character. You can be put in what feels like a zero gravity simulation. And you can float, like an organelle in a cell. But how do we get all this energy, you may ask? Well, that's because of the chloroplasts. The chloroplasts are solar panels outside the park that don't ruin your experience, but instead help you by providing our energy. These chloroplasts do this by harvesting glucose from the sun, which then gets transferred to the mitochondria. The mitochondria then transforms the glucose into energy by breaking it down. The energy the mitochondria makes does power up our park, but you can also buy energy from the mitochondria only for $5.99. Take it home as a gift or a souvenir, whatever you like, but just know it comes from the mitochondria. Next, we have the Diffusion Bumper Car Ride. In this ride, you are on a bumper car team. Your goal is to push an equal number of balls on a field split in half in your bumper car to reach a state of equilibrium or when there are an equal number of balls on both sides. This is a great way to teach your child or your significant other about teamwork. But, Rachel, is there a water part section in Cell World? Yes, there is, my fellow citizen. Now, we have the osmosis dump. Similar to the diffusion bumper cars, the osmosis dump is about reaching equilibrium, but with water. Again, you are on one of two teams. There is a pool on each side that measures how many gallons of water are in it. Both teams' goal is to get an equal amount of water in both pools before the time runs out. Still not impressed? There's also the active transport ball race. This is a race of strength and speed. Whoever can roll their ball up the hill the fastest, scoring from low to high, wins the race. Think you are up for the challenge? Are you tired of all these races and games, and you just want to sit down and eat your energy from the mitochondria? Well, good news for you, we have other entertainment sources. Here, we have a boxing ring of the kingdoms. Eukaryote versus prokaryote. Let's see who wins. The dumb prokaryote loses. It doesn't have a brain after all. Next up we have multicellular versus unicellular. Let's see who wins. It's a tie. No one lost because the match's time ran up. For autotroph versus heterotroph. I guess heterotroph wins? I don't know. Can I get a stage manager back here? And see kids, this is why being a heterotroph is a much better defense mechanism than being an autotroph. Maybe you should eat other things instead of make food for yourself. Anyways, thank you for watching this commercial and remember to visit Cell World. Now, on to your video.